Hi guys. Uh, in this session, we're going to be looking at uh, simplifying expressions. So to get started, I've got to go through some facts first. So the very first thing you need to know that is in maths, we don't always use some multiplication sign. Um, for example, if you want to say something like four times X, um, we actually write this as four X. Okay, that's, that's just the way it is. Um, and if you want to multiply two terms, um, say for example, you have um, something like this, where you have 2a times uh, 4b, then this can be written as, because we know that 4x, well, in the previous example, 4x was 4 times x, we can say that this is 2 times a times 4 times b, and we can just write this as 4 times 2, which is 8, and then a and b is just going to be 8ab. Now another key thing to remember that um, with algebraic terms is that you always write um, the letters in alphabetical order. So for example, this answer, you could also have written it as 8ba or, well, what else could we do? Probably ba8, but it just uh, in maths, what we do is we always write um, the number first, uh, then the alphabet, whatever variable that is that we're using. All right. So if you do write this as 8BA, you're not you're not wrong, but it's just in maths we write it as 8AB. Okay. Now what about division? If you are doing um, say something like 3x divided by 5, this would be um, you know, we just write it as a, as a almost in a fraction form, 3x over 5. Cool, that's just to get started with. And then uh, the next thing that I wanted to talk to you guys about is uh, index forms. So what, I'm, what do I mean by in index forms? So for example, let's say you take x and you multiply it by x and another x and another x. Well, this is written in an index form where we write it as x to the power of 4. So basically what it means is uh, you're actually taking x and you're multiplying it um, by itself four times. Now, one of the things that people end up doing is that when they see x times x times x times x, they actually put it as 4x. And this is actually wrong because remember, 4x is actually four times x, but and that's not what we have um, on the blue side because we've actually got x multiplied by itself four times. All right. So give you another example. If I have something like z to the power of 3, then this is just saying z times z times z. Now some of you might ask again, why is this not equal to 3z? Well, let's say, um, for example, z is equal to something like, I don't know, if we put z is equal to uh, 4 then z cubed is equal to 4 times 4 times 4, which is 64. But 3z is 3 times z, which is 3 times 4, which equals 12. And as you can see, that these two numbers here are not the same. And so that format there is actually incorrect for z times z times z. Cool. That's it for this session, guys. Uh, thanks for watching, and, and I'll keep adding um, more to this videos. Thanks again.